No good. And Addie Wagner is clutching her knee down at the baseline. Hopefully she's all right. Shot up and good. That time by number 21, Cassie Erickson. And Addie Wagner is still down. Yeah, she was clutching her left knee there. The Alliance All-Star game, not high school regulations. It's 20-minute halves as you had coast-to-coast the other way. Getting the bucket. Cassie Erickson from Grafton High going to the University of Mary. Shot clock running down under 10. Dribbles in the lane. They kick it to her teammate, Burian. Easy shot up off the glass. Rattles around and in. First bucket of the night for Mercer Burian. 4-2 is your score on the Hornbacher scoreboard. And she'll bring the ball up the court. Penetrates on that Class A defense. It's a nice bank shot off the glass there. Freegie for two. Yeah, Jalen Cotton just swatted a pass away, was able to get the board back, and they kick it back up to the top. Looking this time for McIver. Decided pass. not to. Low post shot off the glass is good for Molly Muslin. But yeah, I like it. And Class A is, or Class B, excuse me, is off and running. Kicks it out to the corner. Drives down the lane. A little baseline shot by Jalen Cotton. She gets it to go in on the basketball floor uh, since she can play pretty much every position on it. But she's going to go to Alabama to play softball. She knocks down a little floater there. Easy to do. I know James and myself would have a tough time trying to get that layup against her. <laughs> but she cuts down the lane, rim runs, as they say. It's a nice pass and an easy deuce there. So 15 to 6 on the horn. Pass down inside to Naba. And she gets a nice feed there from her teammate and puts it in. Dukeshire's arm with her on that layup attempt to drop it. But she looks a lot bigger than 5'10". Now a nice three-pointer knocked down once again by Megan Rube. I guess three-game losing streak to uh, Class A. They want to come out and get a, get a victory tonight. Shreema pass underneath to Nabwa. Baseline shot rattles around and in. So right. Nabwa getting, trying to write down my stats, and then I lost track of who was uh, picking up that charge. But they were planted and got it good. Nice pass by Dukeshire over on that left-hand side over to Reagan Hansen. 22, Taryn Johnson. Class B off the running pass underneath. I got to pass it back out. Gets it to her teammate, number 21, Cassie Erickson. Her third bucket of the game. She brings the ball up. Freegee picks up her dribble, gives it back over to McIver. Drives down the lane, left-hand scoop shot, good. the likes of that. She has some handles too. She can lead an offense, lead a charge as Marissa Burian knocks down her first three. Rebounds on that. Another three. No good by Olivia Manson. Rebounded by Dukeshire. Under pressure. Gets it off to her teammate. Nice cutting and passing there. Pass it over to Quinn Neppel. So a nice deep three that time by Marissa Burian. Why not? Man, She's oh feeling. man. Ball up court for Class B. Right, left wing three, excuse me, on the way, good by Bailey Pierce. No. I was almost going to say Dallin because she almost had it. Rebound at that time by Bailey Pierce. She's off and running, wide open teammate underneath. Rebound, uh, layup is good to Megan Rube. 47 to 28 here in favor of Class B, under a minute to go. Deep three once again by Marissa Berrien. She is feeling it from deep. Gets it back outside to Hanson. Hanson drives across the lane, now down the lane, off the glass, and good. Nice drive. Missed by Dolan, and Dukeshire has the ball off and running by herself. Euro stepped through the lane, off the window, and good. Dukeshire just makes it look effortless. And then you have to do a floater over a third defender. That shouldn't look effortless. Uh, Olivia Manson, just as her dad said, gets the three-pointer to go. Last ace tournament last year. Deep three by Marissa Berrien is good. You betcha. Total from last night. Dukeshire corner to her teammate, Rue, for two. She's up to ten points. Double digits for her now. Now drives down the lane. Now spacer in the corner for three. You betcha. Her first three of the evening. At the free throw line, down inside. Back up top to Rube for three. Bang. <laughs> Megan Rube. Her third three of the evening. She's into double figures tonight as well, I believe. 
Rebound batted out. Now off and running is Class B. Up and good for Morgan Frege. Hauk gives a shoulder fake, drives in, tries to create some space. Shrema from just past the free throw line, good. Emily Shrema, I think this last season, James, she really shook the midway point midway here in the point. second half. And now boys jumper's good, so it's a 70. Class B has been in control for quite some time. Led by Abby Dukeshire, she finds her teammate Pierce. So she knocks down a three, you betcha. Their chance to talk with her, see what she's seen and liked from her potential new recruits as Emily Shreeman knocks down a three-pointer. All trying to find a, a way into that 2-3 uh, zone that Class A switched to. Three-pointer on the way is good by Jalen Cotton. So they're just handing out threes like Oprah Winfrey. Thought about a three-pointer there by Muslim, but it lost the handle back underneath the roof, and she gets it to go. Nice. Yeah, I'm sure the coaching staff for <laughs> MSM softball would love that. A little shot up and in that time by Reese Hauk. And Rube's going to drive, kick over to her teammate there on the right wing. Shot up and good that time by Cassie Erickson. Her first bucket since she passed inside. Shot up and good that time by Morgan Frege. Nice post move there by Morgan. Frege showing off some post moves there. A little pivot around. Now stolen by Annie Knobway. And she's off to the races. Dukeshire, I thought she might try and block that one, but she let it go. It's an all-star game. It's all cool. Find her teammate open underneath. Layup is up and good by Jalen Cotton. 88-64. And Dukeshire's going to come up with that rebound there. And she'll lead the break once again. No look past her teammate, Taryn Johnson. Up for the layup is good. They were, they were just showing kind of, you know what, there, there's not much of a discretion difference from Class A to Class B as Taylor Shafransky knocks down a three-pointer. 